Hey guys, go to Boy32, and uh, one of the things we did in the past, we did a, uh, a video review of Condor's Recon, the uh, the hydration uh, straps, and the the bib. Okay, so what we're going to do now is going to go ahead and assemble this whole thing, put it into somewhat of an action, uh, at least within my shop here, and uh, just show you some of the capacity things. Um, with some magazines as it looks as a whole. So what we're going to do is gonna bring the camera in, go ahead and put this thing together for you, okay? So stand by. All right, guys, so Coda Boy 32 here. And uh, basically, all right, so what we got is we got the Condor rig. We got a nice big old fat first aid rip away pouch here. And uh, he's got the vertical. Now, one of the things is we got to go back and install this, uh, this uh, holster correctly because he didn't web it uh, properly feed it through the webbing there, but you know what, it's a learning lesson for old Melster. So anyway, let's go ahead and start. For the first thing we're going to do, we're going to remove the existing straps, okay? And it's pretty easy. Just here, here, remove that, and remove that, okay? So, you can take your straps, go ahead and store those in a location that you know you're not going to lose them, because guys, trust me, when it comes to keeping track of all my stuff, I can't keep track of anything. I uh, God damn, I, I damn, I lost a freaking scope. And I can't believe it. I'm kicking myself in the ass because I can't find the damn thing, no matter what I want to do. And it was a pretty nice scope. <laughs> it's around the house somewhere. I'm thinking the kids probably picked it up. Hey, look, Daddy, pirate, pirate uh, thingy. What do you call this thing? Total thing. All right. So anyway, what we're left with here is the waistband. Okay, so what we're going to do is just make sure that that's there. Uh, if you guys have any questions about the uh, the recon system, go ahead and uh, ask them now because we got it. Here's a good view of it. But anyway, there we go. So what we're going to do, we're going to take the hydration pack, okay, and we're going to install it. Now, simply just lay it right here and connect it back in the same location. you got to be real stupid. I can't figure this out. Okay, because uh, obviously this ain't going to fit there. <laughs> Don't mean to be an asshole, but that's basically the way it is. Alright, so we're going to roll this thing over. I'm here, you bastard. Go ahead. Feed these diagonal straps. They don't cross. They go straight down, which I think is a very good plus. The way you see this thing when I put it on. Okay, so now we've got this pretty much established here. Okay, we're going to go ahead and feed the waistband through this portion, this little webbing here. Okay, and this is going to keep that backside of the hydration pack down and, and uh, tied into this thing as one piece. And for right now, I'm going to go ahead and just pop that in there. Okay, so what's your ending up with is this thing right here. Now what we want to do is I want to install the chest bib portion. Now this is this thing's not set up for me so it's gonna look silly. So what I'm gonna do is I want to go ahead I'm gonna take these molly straps and I'm just gonna temporarily feed them through so we can just get an idea what this thing's going on. There were some people that said that these do not come with this kit so you may have to order these separately make sure you check on these things okay uh, if so i think these are like 4.99 or something stupid like that but anyway you can uh, take a look at that so what we're going to do is i'm going to go ahead because i've got a large torso i'm going to go ahead and feed those through the lower lowest portion of this thing i might have to tighten these straps up just a tad because it's going to look silly otherwise let's go ahead and do that And I'm just going to push those up. Okay, those are pretty, pretty much the same. Let's go ahead and feed this in here. And like I said, this is just for temporary for video purposes. Video purposes only here, fellas. Video purposes here only. I had a heck of a weekend here. It's been a lot of fun. Me and my little boy, we're going to go out and... Uh, final place to shoot his BB gun. He's funny. He's like, Daddy, I want to do a review on my BB gun. And uh, 
really interesting. My uh, brother and my sister found a vintage BB gun, Red Rider, solid wood, by the way, lever action. And he's like, and then I want to do a review on it, just like you, Daddy. So I'm like, that is absolutely the coolest thing. All right, so anyway, we got this thing mounted here. And basically, this bib section is going to feed into this pocket area here. So you have, and this is one of the things that I do like about this rig, is it gives you a, a nice um, one-piece system versus the one that I have, the modular chest rig, which the shit's all over the place. However, with the modular chest rig, you have the ability to put a lot more stuff on here. So, all right, so let's go ahead. We're going to don this thing and uh, see how it fits. Now, like I said, I'm a lot bigger than my buddy Mel, and uh, we'll see how it goes from there. So anyway, I'm going to move the camera. Be right back. Stand by. All right, boys and girls, we're back All right now. Look, I'm going to have a little coffee here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and try to put this thing on. i got my microphone, so we're going to have to deal with that, with that thing for a little bit. And then what I'm going to do is load this thing up with a couple items and then uh, go from there to show you how the fit and finish looks. Anyway, oh, coffee, hold on. Mm -mm -mm. All right, so I'm going to set the microphone down here real quick. I'll take my glasses off. Get a little hat. Ugh. All right, so anyway, I was telling you about the... We're just going to go ahead and... <laughs> Continue on with a story here. Uh, put this thing on first. Anyway, you're gonna take it like this. Put it on. Boom, you're done. And I'll be honest with you, dude. I like the shit out of this thing. It. Uh, I wish they had some more stuff here to the side. Hold on one second. Let me get this thing figured up. Hey, we'll just put that thing right there. All right. So anyway, I really do like this. I mean, I, I like the way it fits. Good God. Um, it's very, ta very, very tight. Uh, it's up high. You can put your uh, combat belt down here below. Go ahead and uh, put the old pistol in. Uh, in here. Go ahead and load some magazines up. Now, the um, thing about these uh, kangaroo pouches, you got a front and back, and there's a divider in there, so you have to be careful about when you do put your mags in, make sure that you're on the either side of the divider. Okay. I won't be an airborne ranger. I hope that everybody checked in on their buddy on uh, check, buddy check 22 the other day. I uh, did have some sad news. Uh, I haven't confirmed it 100%, but uh, yeah, one of my uh, one of my dearest friends uh, is no longer with us. So anyway, I'm having to deal with that. No, but I mean, uh, whatever. We'll talk about it later. All right. So anyway, got a couple mags here. Got some mag pouches. One thing. Uh, what the hell happened there? The only thing that I'm not too pleased with. And I'm only finding this out now, because this is kind of an ongoing thing. What the hell, man? Get your happy ass right there. Uh, the mag pouches, these things stick way out here. I'd rather have them up here, okay? Because uh, I, I don't mind these things out where they are, but I don't want shit sticking out so far. Uh, laying in the prone might be a pain in the ass. And you can, you know, put a flashlight in there if you need. Or, uh, you know, some flares or whatever. But anyway. Guys, that's it. Hydration pack. Uh, I do like this Molly webbing thing. Here. This thing's nice. And I, you know what? I'm going to try and incorporate it on that thing right there. I think we can. It's one way or another. But uh, all right. That's it, guys. This is the recon with the bib kit and the hydration pack all in one. All right. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, give a thumbs up, man. Subscribe. Again, we got some really cool stuff coming up here in the future. Let's see here. Hey. That's my combat rifle. All right. 
This is my uh, go-to baby. This is the one that uh, sits in the front of the safe. In the event that shit hits the fan at the house, this is the one I'm going to. <laughs> deal. Anyway, that being said, if you're in uniform, watch your six. And as always, God bless America. God bless those men and women in uniform 24-7 for our freedom. It's Code Boy 32. And the recon system. Out. Not bad.